Hey everyone, it's Caitlin and welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you my favorite vegan snacks from Trader Joe's. I think Trader Joe's is a great store to go to if you're looking for vegan snacks because they are really vegan friendly. A lot of their snack items are accidentally vegan, but they even have some things that specifically cater to vegans as well. Now I will admit that some of these snacks are pretty healthy, while others are not necessarily what I would consider a health food, but it's also fun to have snack foods every once in a while, and these foods are also great to show to your family and friends how easy it is to be vegan and how there are actually a lot of vegan options. So without further ado, I'm just going to go through all the things that I just got and explain them a little bit. So the first thing is this Trader Joe's Brownie Crisp. And this stuff is dangerously addictive. I always get it for people when I do box swaps with them to other countries. It's kind of like the crispy edges around the brownie in like little chips. And then there's chocolate chips inside too. So I would definitely recommend this. Um, there are a few other companies who sell this as well, but this is just the Trader Joe's brand. It's called Inner Peas. They're almost kind of like the consistency of cheese puffs but they're made from peas and they're kind of shaped like peas as well, as you can see from the package. But these are really light and they're actually pretty low in sodium, which I appreciate with more snack foods. So I get these every once in a while. Okay, if you know me and have been following me, you already know that I'm obsessed with this, but the Trader Joe's Chili Spice Mango is literally to die for. If you like spicy food, this is totally up your alley. It is a little spicy, but it's dried mango, and then they put some salt, um, sugar, and chili flakes on it, and just the combination of sweet, spicy, and salty is so amazing, and this is not even bad for you at all, so I do not feel guilty when I may or may not accidentally eat the whole package. This next thing, I'm not really sure exactly what they are, but they're these savory thin mini crackers. I believe they're mostly made from rice. Yeah, they're mostly made from rice flour and they have some sesame seeds and soy sauce flavoring in them as well. And I think these are really great as sort of party chips or they're really nice to dip in hummus because even though they do have a distinct flavor on their own, it's pretty neutral when you pair it with other things. So I just think they're a good light snack to have. So another cool thing about Trader Joe's is they actually have vegan caramel popcorn, which I have never seen at any other store before because usually there's milk or butter in the caramel. But this is really low in fat too, so it qualifies as a high carb, low fat snack. So you could totally just bring this to the movies with you if you wanted a snack and you can just say no thank you to all the buttery nastiness that's in movie theater popcorn. Okay, this next one is a little bit more unique, but I don't know if all of you have heard of the fruit jackfruit, but it's more of an Asian fruit, but it actually tastes like juicy fruit bubble gum in the best way possible. So Trader Joe's has these jackfruit chips so the fruit itself is like kind of puffed up. I'll insert a picture of here of the original fruit. Um, they're kind of shaped like pods. So it's these pods in chip form. And these are super sweet and it's such a unique flavor. So if you live in the United States, sometimes it can be harder to get your hands on jackfruit. But if you want to try it and you're really curious, this is definitely a good way to try it. And I would really recommend them. And then next I have these Speculoos cookies. And these are kind of like a gingery, caramelly, cinnamony type of cookie, I guess. It's really hard to explain, but if you've had cookie butter before, it's this. This is ground up to make cookie butter. But these are just a fun little snack, and a lot of cookies obviously are not vegan, so it's cool that these are. And they even say vegan on the package right there, which is always a plus. And then finally, this is not a Trader Joe's brand, but currently Trader Joe's is having like a mango fest, and they have so many mango flavored everything. But I came across these mango and ginger chews. I don't know if you've all had ginger chews before, but it doesn't taste like licorice, but it's chewy like licorice, and it's just made from ginger. And I am obsessed with ginger, so I love those. But then when I saw it come out with mango, I was like, game changer, 100% buying this. So I got these, and they're seriously so addicting. I have another package, and I already ate like a third of it, and I bought this yesterday. But if you ever see these anywhere, I would 100% recommend them. And they have other flavors too. So if you don't like ginger and mango, they also have a peanut butter flavor, peppermint, and an orange flavor too. So it could be something new to try, and it's definitely a healthier alternative to really sugary candy, which most of the time isn't even vegan anyways. 
And actually, I think this is a new product at Trader Joe's. I've never really seen it before, so I haven't tried it, but I wanted to share it with you all. It's an organic and fair trade dark chocolate wand. And this one is a raspberry flavor, but they also had a espresso flavor and an original flavor as well. And I just thought it was cool that Trader Joe's has like vegan chocolate bars now because most of their bars unfortunately have milk in them. And it was neat that it came in other flavors as well. And I also really appreciate that it's fair trade and organic, which are two things that are important to me. All right, guys, and that sums up this video. I hope this showed you that it can be easy to find vegan snacks wherever you go, especially at Trader Joe's because it's just an awesome store in general. If you guys want me to do more videos of vegan snacks at other stores like Aldi or Walmart or Target, definitely let me know in the comments below and let me know which one you would want to see first. I actually think this was really fun to film and it was cool to look at all the labels for things and to see what vegan snacks are actually available because most of the time it's often more than you think. So thank you all so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye.